G'day everyone, how are we all doing? Welcome back once again to another movie reaction and today we are going to be watching 2022's Barbarian which released on August 31st I believe in the United States in theatres and only the other week here in Australia. I've been waiting so long to watch this because I'm a massive fan of just different horror movies. I've heard you don't know necessarily what to expect. I've heard things from friends of mine that this is one of the most different, unexpected horror movies when it comes to the twists, the turns, what the story is actually about, that the trailer gave away nothing. I still refused to watch the damn fucking trailer. I mean, this movie's been out for two months in the United States and it only got released maybe a week or two ago in Australia, and I still haven't seen this movie. I'm watching this finally for the first time now because... There's a fucking truck outside. <laughs> I'm finally watching it now because it's just released on HBO Max the other day in America and, you know, I'm in Australia. How the fuck am I watching this thing? Using NordVPN, I am able to watch it on HBO Max because a mate of mine gave me his account. No, this is not a fucking plug. You think I get sponsors? Heck, <laughs> you're funny. But it features Georgina Campbell, Justin Long, Bill Skarsgård. I love this cast and I, you know, am curious to see what Zach Krieger... I believe that's how you say his name, spiced up with this movie. I stayed away from the marketing, as I said, so I don't get spoiled of anything. I am curious to see what this movie has to, you know, provide. So guys, without further ado, enough talking. Let's jump in and let's watch 2022's Barbarian. This soundtrack already is fucking haunting. What the hell? Oh my god. This is why I have my backpack and everything right next to me whenever I'm driving alone, so therefore I don't have to worry about this. I can take it out with me and get the fuck inside. Oh, you've gotta be kidding me. There's no key? Huh? Well, that's a bit scummy. It's too dark, I can't see anything! <laughs> oh, smart girl, she's actually waiting in her car. Most horror characters are stupid and won't do that. Someone's inside... Hello? Yeah. Hiya, Georgie! What a nice boat. Do you want a back? This is 476 Barbary, right? I don't know. Yeah, yeah. I think so. You don't know? No. <gasps> I don't live here. I'm renting this place. It's the middle of the night. I don't have it at the top of my head, the address. No, I, I'm oh. renting this place. So, so there's been a fuck up with the real estate. Uh, what? Oh, never mind. It's an Airbnb. Okay. There, that's the issue. Why don't you, why don't you come inside and we'll call these idiots. At least he's got a fucking sensible head on his shoulders. He's one, a respectful gentleman. He won't let her go out in the rain or just tell her to fuck off. And two, he has the right idea with let's call these fucking idiots. Would you mind pulling up your reservation confirmation just so I can see it? In case I'm some kind of weirdo who's broken in here to sleep? Yes, that's exactly right. Like, that, that, that's not an unfair request. Then I also mention, you're gonna need that info to talk to the idiots, you know, with the real estate. Here. <gasps> oh, you Jesus. fucking wanker! Don't do that! Don't sneak up on people, you fuck! I guess I'll just find somewhere else. I mean... Yep. Guess I'm gonna do that. Uh, I'll let you get back to sleep. I feel bad. It's clearly not your fault. What are you gonna do? Just go drive around looking for a hotel. Do what I do, sleep in the car. Do what I do, sleep in the car. No, don't, 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 don't do that. Don't do that, that's not safe. Obviously, you do whatever you want, but if, if you want to hang out in here, uh, where it's dry and there's a lock on the door, I'm totally fine with that. He's such a gentleman. He's such a gentleman. Good on you, Skarsgård. Good on you. you. You know what I just realized? Oh, the, the water's heating up, by the way. You know what I just realized? What's that? There's a convention in town. What? Yeah, there's like some huge medical thing. I don't, I don't think you're going to be able to get a room tonight. No, that explains why she can't get a place or anything when she's calling up and everything. That, that explains it. Ooh. Uh, hey. Ooh. 
The way he's sitting there, all plank. Ooh, why is he all set up like that? Why is... Mm. I thought I'm gonna have some of this here wine, but I didn't want to open it before um, you got out of the shower because I, I know you didn't drink your tea. Oh my god, dude, 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 just calm down. Calm down, you, need, you don't need to try so hard, just, just simmer down a bit. You're being a bit pushy. But if I open it while you weren't here, that, um, that, um, fuck, I'm, 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 I'm sorry, I'm rambling, Jesus Christ. Um, <laughs> He's like me! He's like me when I ramble. Whenever I ramble, I start to stutter and then I get up myself and I just, you know, fucking bag myself a bit. I, I get it, I get it. I mean, there's a lot of bad dudes out there and it sucks. Like, are you gonna stay locked into some fucked up toxic dynamic that somebody else picked for you? Or are you, are you gonna move on? Maybe find someone else. Even if that means that you may get your heart ripped out of your chest all over again. There is a lot going on with this conversation here. And I haven't been talking. But the thing is, is that I'm so invested in this conversation. Because their dynamic and their chemistry together right now is so good. Like, it's just bouncing back and forth off of each other with, like, a genuine conversation. And it's... I'm just stuck in it. You'll thank me later when you're lying under a perfectly even <laughs> duvet here. So, so dumb. If, but so here, <laughs> right? Here's where I kind of need your help a little bit. Oh no! What the fuck is going on here? What is he doing? Oh my God. <laughs> a little aggressive. <laughs> what is he doing? <laughs> but that is how you get. <laughs> that is incredibly impressive. I'm not gonna lie. I'm gonna have to try that sometime. I bet. I'll try that next winter! Okay, thank you for, for, for tonight. No, sorry. That was incredibly fucking awkward. Oh my god, that was so awkward, that little pause there. You two get to bed. Get to bed. You couch. You bed. Sleep. Ugh. That very subtle creaking without the music is very unsettling. What the hell? Whoa. What the fuck was that? What the fuck was that? Keith? He's having withdrawals. It's no not November, guys. It's no not November. He's having withdrawals. He's having a bad dream about it. Keith. Yep, it's definitely no not November withdrawals. Ah! I saw that door close in the background. What the hell? Um. Ah! Oh! Oh! Yeah! Fuck! Uh, I'm so sorry. What, what, are you, what, are you, what are you doing? Holy shit, did you put your keep it junior madonna hamana? I have no idea what's going on right now. What the. Oh, wow. Yeah, I'd be locking that door and making sure it can't fucking open. I don't know why it'd be like that. Um... I had to run, please leave the key in the black box and see this and break a leg. K. P.S. had a great light last night. Oh, that's actually kind of sweet. Oh, what a nice guy. What a nice guy. He actually left behind a note so she knew. Oh. Oh. That is a very strange neighbor. What the frick? Why are all the houses on the block so desolate and then it's just the one house on the block that they're staying and that's actually nice? Everything around here is so run down. I'm a little confused to be perfectly frank with you. So, where are you staying while you're in town? Oh, an Airbnb. Oh, that's nice. Whereabouts? Uh, it's in, uh, Brentmore. You know where that is? What? Hmm? Okay, there's something suspicious about this. I mean, yeah, it seems a little rough, but... No, you shouldn't be there. What do you mean? What? Why? Why? Why the hell? I, I, I have a roommate, so... It's, uh, it's a little complicated. <laughs> I guess. Okay, well, just be careful, okay? Well, they... There's something she's not saying. She's there's something she's not telling her. What what what's this about Brightmore? What's this about? What's it, this about the place? What's so bad about? It? I know it's a, li a little run down, but there's something she's not s telling her about the place. What's so bad about it? Oh, I feel a jump scare on the way. I feel a jump scare on the way. It's just setting up for it right now. It's setting up. For Whoa! What's that down the street? What's that? 
Who's that running? Why? Wait, 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 wait. Who's that running? Come here! Whoa! What the fuck? Hey, little girl! Come out that house! Go away! Whoa. Come out that house! No, I don't want to come out that house. I don't want to come out that house. What the fuck is wrong with you? Why was he doing that? Oh no, going down there may not be a good idea. Going down into attic is never a good idea in movie. Why does it look very reminiscent of the attic, uh, attic, the basement from it? Like, with the laundry machine, the layout and everything. It looks very reminiscent. Door just closed on itself and oh, look at that. She's locked in. That's always a lot of fun. Oh no. Huh? What? There's a fucking secret passage? Why? Why is this necessary under this house? By the way, grab a brick or a box and put it there so therefore the door can't close. Nope. Oh, she's smart. Good. Good job. She doesn't want to go down there. She's fucking smart about it. I wouldn't go either. Huh, that's a good idea, actually. Reflecting the light down there to see what's there. I mean, if she had a phone, it would be a little bit easier, but... Oh, there's a door handle. There's a door handle. Um, but the thing is, like, if she had a phone, she could just flash it down there and be like, Howdy doody. Uh, what's behind the door? I don't want to know what's behind it. Excuse me? Oh god, what the fuck is this? Why the fuck is there cameras? Well, a camera and a bed and a bucket, what the hell is this? Oh, and a bloody handprint, that's nice. That's nice. That's, that's nice. <laughs> <laughs> what the fuck? What the fuck, what the fuck, what the fuck? Keith! Oh, it's just Keith. It's just fucking Keith. It's just fucking Keith. Hey, we need to go. We need to go now. What are you talking about? Why are we in the basement? We got locked in the basement and then there was this hidden area. There was this room. Yeah, you need you need to leave. You need to fucking... You need to fucking leave. You need to get out of there. This is not a good fucking place to be. There's a hidden room with a fucking camera, a manky old bed, and a fucking random shit bucket. Dungeon. Like a dungeon? What, what, what was in there? There was a bed. Okay. And a camera. And a bucket. And a manky old shit bucket. A manky old shit bucket. It's clearly a room to kidnap people and do really fucking despicable things. Oh, I just, I, I just want to see it. You don't even have to come with me if you don't want to. I'm not going back down there. Oh, that's fine. Understandable. Understandable. Don't go back down there. Just, just stay the fuck upstairs. You're safe upstairs. Don't go down, dude. She's she's a better person than I am. She's a better person than I am. She's staying so in case he gets locked down, the door doesn't shut on him and everything. For me personally, I'd be the fuck out of there. I'd be gone. You're on your own, mate. Survival of the fucking fittest. Keith! Is that another door? Is that another door down the end? Or is there multiple doors? What the fuck? Ugh. It looks like that staircase where Mia turned up at the first time in RE7, like when she was all... <laughs> oh, he's in fucking trouble. He's in fucking trouble. It's time. Yeah, he yelled for help. <laughs> Just run. Just run. I'm sorry. Fuck Keith. I'm out. Rule number what? 32 of Zombieland? Don't be a hero? Don't! Ooh, the score. Oh, the score's amazing. 
<laughs> Who the fuck is behind this? Why are they keeping the, the people as pets? I'm presuming people. Oh my god, is it fucking cannibals? Is it fucking cannibals? <laughs> ah! Fucking bitch! What the fuck? I even heard him crawling closer. I even heard him crawling towards her and it still fucking got me. It still fucking got me. Wait, someone's no, down! No, 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 I'm not going back! No. Um! 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 What the fuck are you? You're just gonna go to a boom dicka boom dicka doom dicka doom dicka doo 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 What the fuck is that tonal change? And what the fuck did I just witness fucking Granny Mac fucking saggy tits here running and bashing Bill Skarsgård's head against a fucking wall? What the hell did I just witness? Someone bit him, but then some saggy Mac shit face comes running down to him, bashes his head against the wall. Is it the work of cannibals? I feel like it's the work of fucking cannibals. But that doesn't explain why doors are unlocking, closing, and opening on their own. And why there's a fucking bed with a video camera. This feels like Cannibal Holocaust meets Hostel meets fucking a Serbian film right now. What the fuck? Let's just continue with this thing. Oh my god. And the organization they really organized. Yes! It's Justin Long, my baby boy. I love Justin Long in horror movies. He's such an underrated horror actor in my opinion. One of my favorite movies ever is Drag Me to Hell and I love him in it. And I loved him in Tusk as well. I know that video got scrapped, but I loved him in it. Yo, what's up? Hi, AJ. Uh, hey, AJ, uh, we need to discuss something that's just come through. Cool, what's up? How can they hear you over the fucking wind that's obviously happening because of you driving up Convertible. Apparently, Megan Maddox has contacted the network through her lawyer, and she's made a very serious accusation against you. Really? What'd she say? She's claimed that you were sexually aggressive during the filming of the pilot. Ooh. Whoa, 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 okay, 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 oh. Wait, wait, wait. what about the pilot? Wait, so I, I, hold on, wait a minute, this is crazy. So are we not picked up anymore? That's the thing you have a problem with! Not the fuck you've been accused of sexual aggression! That- that's the thing you don't have a- Wow. What's she saying I did? Is she saying I her or something? Can't use that word on YouTube? Yes. She's saying that you her. Okay, 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 okay. This is a very serious subject matter. I'm- mm -hmm. <laughs> well, that put a real damper on his fucking mood real fast, didn't it? Oh my wow. <clears throat> May I help you? Yeah, I'm an owner. I'm here to pick up a set of keys. Name? AJ Gilbride. Oh yeah, Bonnie said you'd be coming. This has turned into a very different type of movie very fast. It went from... Pure, like, psychological horror WTF what is going on to a guy who's now trying to sell properties and everything and has traveled to Detroit, Michigan to sell properties and everything because of him being accused of sexual misconduct on a film set. This is taking a very different fucking turn very fast. Oh my god, and of course it's the exact same house that they were just in. Alright, we're back into the fucking fray of things right now. We're back into what we were before. Good job, Justin Long. You've got yourself in another shitty horror situation. What up, faggot? Guess who's back in town? Can we just, like, real talk? Oh, Jesus Christ. That was a fucking tonal change. And I can't use that word right now. Jesus. Saying, like, you're my boy. Obviously, I'm going to believe whatever you tell me. Right, I, right. I got to hear you no, say I know, it. I know. Right? Wrong attitude to have. Don't believe something that someone just says. Actually have evidence in front of you. But anyway. Uh, let me be real with you. We fucked. We did fuck, okay? Right? She just took some convincing is all.
no. If someone says no, but then you convince them, like it takes some convincing, that is still misconduct. That is still fucking wrong in every way, shape, or form. Oh, Christ. In the beginning, she was like, no, oh, whatever, but like, and then we started fooling around more, and then she was down. Like, right. fucking really down. I'm a persistent dude, right? I'm like fucking eye of the tiger. <laughs> yeah, I don't know how to feel about that. That that makes me very uncomfortable. That makes me very uncomfortable. Yeah, like, if someone's not into it and they're like, uh, I don't know, you don't push. You don't push. You you don't be persistent in that regard. You let it be. You let it be. Someone's not interested and they say no. You just. Had a bit too much to drink, didn't we, mate? Yeah, hangovers are fun, aren't they? Hey. Tess. Alright. Okay, so he's found a computer and is trying to get into it to see who the hell she is. Don't throw her fucking computer! God damn it, man! Those things are expensive! Somebody here? Nope, nobody's there, my guy. Nobody's there because they got taken by something or someone with big saggy titties. Okay, here's the deal. I have a gun. No, you don't. No, you fucking don't. Don't lie, dude. That's not gonna scare anyone. Oh, the door's closed. The door, the passageway is now closed and the fucking mirror and everything is still there, so... Huh. He's got to find the doorway somehow. Yep, he's doing the same thing. Opening up with that stupid fucking rope. Yep, he's found the creepy room with the fucking camera in bed. That's maybe where they've been squatting, my guy. Can underground rooms be listed as square footage when... That Google search is too long, mate. You're not gonna be able to fucking find anything. Even a finished basement can't be counted towards a home's gross living area GLA, but it can be noted separately in the listing's total area. Oh, hell yeah. Yeah, bitch. <laughs> He's gonna use that as a means to fucking sell his house. He's gonna use that as a reason to sell his house now that he has that information. <laughs> 10 by 12, that's 120. Three by nine. Ah, oh, crap. He's found the other fucking door. Oh my god, he's gonna go down even further to figure this out. What the fuck is this? I like how he's not even weirded out slightly by the fucking cages. He just asks, what the fuck is this? But doesn't question it any further beyond that. What the fuck, man? You'd have to be calling the police because of this to ask... Why the hell is this all here? I like to let my baby determine how long he likes to nurse. What? But this process is relaxing. Why the fuck is there a breastfeeding video on a small little telly inside? <gasps> Whoa! In this room. Um. Um. Uh. Uh, Justin, you are not alone down there. There is something down there with you, and it just took your fucking tape measure. What? <laughs> I don't like those noises. <laughs> I don't like the noises at all. Oh no, someone's gonna be there. Uh, ew! 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 Airway! Yucky, 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 ya mama! He just had a fucking drop. That's a broken leg for you at this point. Oh my god, what the hell is that thing? Oh. And now he's trapped. He got. <laughs> Hi, Tess. Hi, Tess. How you doing? You're still alive? That's good. That's, that's very fucking good. Um, what the fuck is that thing? What the hell is this? What is going on here? This is so strange! I don't even know what I'm watching. What the hell is this fucking weird- That's really cool though. This is all one take, getting into the car and everything. This is a really cool shot. 
what radio was meant to be. The ultimate musical experience is now 106.9, Detroit's home of the rock. Um, why is he watching that woman and waiting for her to leave? What's he doing? DWP, ma'am. Sorry to bother. No bother. We've got some outages in the neighborhood, and I'm just checking to make sure everything's up to par. No, you're not. You're fucking snooping and fucking creeping on her, dude. Give us a call if you get any issues. Of course, thank you. You have a nice day now. What a creepy bastard. Wait, what 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 was the point of that? What was the fucking point of that? Okay, so it is the exact house, 476 and whatnot, but it's just been slightly refurbished since. Oh my god, I heard that. There was someone screaming down there. There was someone screaming down there. What the hell? Why is some... What the fuck? Very important. You need to stay calm. You cannot freak out around her, okay? Trust me. I don't want to be here. Do you think I want to fucking be here? Okay, just do what Tess says. Do what Tess says, stupid. Do what fucking Tess says. Just don't get upset, otherwise she'll get upset. Just stay calm. Oh! Ew! Why? Fucking why? <laughs> what are you? Don't you see? She just wants you to be her baby. <laughs> what? Yucky! Yucky! No, I don't want him to be her baby. I don't want her to be anyone to be her baby. I don't want anyone to be her baby. Why? <laughs> brush your teeth, brush your teeth, brush your teeth. Oh my god. You need to wipe your nose, you need to brush your teeth, you need a fucking dentist, mate. Uh oh. Uh oh. Uh oh. Uh -oh. Uh -oh. Uh Justin Long's dead. Justin Long is definitely dead. Oh no, ah oh, well. And that's another one to the count, I guess, because I don't think he's coming back. <laughs> back now! Perfectly now. Oh my god, what? What is she doing to him? What is she do The boop! 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 <laughs> She's not gonna breastfeed him, is she? No! No 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 Ew What in the actual fuck Oh no Um I think Mama Bear definitely heard that you should definitely run Tess You should definitely run This is why you should always be aware of your surroundings when it comes to where you're walking Yes! Smash it open and get out, Tess! Smash it and get out! Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on! Oh no, that's not good. Ew! Ewy! Ewy! She's so disgusting. I know it, I know she's in there. No, she has someone else in the room. Wait, he was trying to help her the whole time. Oh my god, the guy we saw earlier was trying to help her. She will kill him! I need to help him! And how you gonna do that? Come back time. She's gonna come out of there. She's gonna come looking for you. She comes out at night. What? So if you she comes out at night. Go. No, no. So that's why the doors were opening and closing by themselves because she was outside. She was outside while they were sleeping. <laughs> oh, it's time for you to run, Justin. Justin, do not listen for her and do not stop. Just keep fucking running. Ew! Ew, it's so dark, but you can still make out her figure. Justin, get the fuck out! Why is she backing up? Why is she backing up? Oh, she knows that this is a family friendly YouTube channel and she knows that titties can't be shown on the screen. Ah. Uh...
Is that the lady that we saw before? The, um, the woman that, um... <laughs> oh, mate, was stalking. What? I noticed the dress. <laughs> Ew! 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 It's him! It's the guy that we saw earlier. What the fuck are you doing down here? What the fuck are these videotapes? What the fuck? Whoa, whoa, whoa. I need to read these. I need to read these. Brunette, crazy, Ruby, pregnant, Brenda, very old, Asian, what the? Liquor clerk, smiley, old, Jane, screamer, hitchhiker, Stephanie, Sarah M, cab driver, won't stop crying. What the hell is all this? Are these like weird porn tapes? Puka, blind, Tonya, gas station, redhead. What the hell is any of this? Don't put the tape and I don't think I really want to know. I don't actually want to know. Oh, Jesus Christ, that scared the shit out of me. A fucking rock through the window. Crap. Oh, but she comes out at night. She comes out at night. No, why are you... Oh. Oh. No, oh. no, 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 oh. wait! Wait! Oh. He, um, unalived himself, to say the least. He... Ah! Fuck me! Run, 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 run the bitch over her fat fucking saggy titties! My neighbors will be questioning a lot of what I just said if they heard me. <laughs> what the hell am I watching? Just bashed open the fucking door and came with the fucking flippity floppity flippity floppity. I can't get past the saggy titties. <laughs> My recommendation, yeah. Okay, there we go. I was gonna say, my recommend- I love that shot, by the way. My recommendation to Justin Long is that he runs out with the gun, with the flashlight and everything, and uses it as a way to walk around to get out. Because therefore he at least has a defense weapon. Oh no, he's- <gasps> He's probably gonna shoot Tess. He's probably gonna shoot Tess. Oh no, Hello. don't- <gasps> Ah! No, I knew it! I fucking knew it! I knew he would shoot her! Oh, come on! Come on, we gotta get you out of here. Come on. Ah! I'm sorry, I'm sorry! Ah! Not a good idea to move her right now. But they really don't have a choice, do they? She's not there. What? No! She's, she's gone! The bitch is gone! The bitch is gone! No, where is she? What is this place? He's gotta be here somewhere. Who? Hey! Oh! Hi, bro! Hey, bro! How you doing? How you doing? Oh my god, he's back and he's actually letting them in. He's letting them in. Oh my god, safe haven. Safety, 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 safety. Yes! She's been living there some 40 years now. She was born there. What are you talking about? I own that house. Somebody lives there. What? Oh my god, it's the um, baby that was going to be born that he was shopping for supplies for, and it's a woman that he... He used to bring women down there. And then you know. he started making babies with them. And babies with the babies. And you make a copy of a copy of a copy. <laughs> no! Why? No! 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 It don't matter whose fault it is. It does. I hurt somebody. That matters. I don't know if I'm a bad person. But I might be. I might be a bad person. Or maybe I'm... I'm a good person who just did a bad thing. Is that his acknowledgement to what he did earlier and he's finally coming to terms with it because he shot her and is experienced down there? Is... That's basically our confirmation that he actually did it. I've been living in this place more than 15 years and she ain't never came in this motherfucker. Ah! You were fucking wrong! You were fucking wrong! You were so dead! Oh my god, she just tore his arm. Clean off and is, I presume, bashing his head in with his own, you know, torn off arm. Holy fucking shit. I can't say I didn't see that coming because I definitely saw it coming in a way, but I didn't expect it to be like that. Whoa. Wait for me. Come on. Oh, come on. No, she fell down. Justin Long, go back and fucking help her. 
uh, 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 she's climbing. She's climbing. They climb now. I can get away. But you're gonna have to slow her down. Are you kidding me? He really is just a bad fucking person. Are you fucking shitting me? What? I know it's to save his own ass. And. Uh, that was a weird shot. That was really fucking weird. Uh, okay. Holy shit. The big saggy titty lady is dead. I think Tess may have survived, but the big saggy titty lady protected her. So was the saggy titty lady a bad person or did it just want a baby? Oh my god, she's still alive. She's still alive. Thank god, thank god. I want her to live, not Justin Long. You, you can be okay, I got you. I'm, I'm saving you. You're okay. <laughs> Fuck, how is she still alive? At least we get to see Justin Long die now. He is just a shitty fucking person. I hate him. I hate him. I love Justin Long, but I hate this character. Oh. Please show me. Please show me the door. Oh! <laughs> It's like that kill in Terrifier 2. Oh my god. Oh my fucking god. What the hell? What the hell? Is it not bad at all? What the fuck? I don't think it's actually a bad fucking creature. I'm, I'm not even going to call it a person at this point. It's a creature wanting to protect her and everything. It's not a bad thing. It's just unfortunate that it's been, you know, created through such a means that was explained earlier. What a way to fucking end. What the hell? I can't play any of this music right now because it is very copyrighted, but what? All right, well, that was Barbarian. Um, what the fuck did I just watch? The thing I'll say immediately off the bat with Barbarian is that it is a vastly tense, very mysterious, and very well put together movie. I actually think that this is a very fun, unique concept that takes its time to build up to all the weird fucking shit in the third act with characters like Tess and uh, like Keith and everything played brilliantly by Georgina Campbell and Bill Skarsgård with a great midpoint when Skarsgård dies and everything as Keith and then has that tonal shift to introduce Justin Long as our new character. Justin Long. Great performance on his part. He is, again, a great actor, especially in the sense when it comes to the horror category of filmmaking. The genre of horror is one that I've loved forever, as you guys know, and it's actors like Justin Long who always give their all in movies like this, movies like Drag Me to Hell, movies like Tusk, that he is an absolute fucking gem. Same with Georgina Campbell, who was absolutely incredible in this movie. I loved her as Tess. She was a great final fucking girl or if you want to call her a final girl character, just a lead character in general. But Justin Long's character was one that I couldn't get behind in the end. I, when the subject matter was immediately brought up in regards to him possibly committing sexual uh, misconduct or sexual assault on his co-worker that he got the job for in regards to this production, I wanted to give his character the benefit of the doubt because there are always two sides of the coin and everything when it comes to there could be true accusations or it could be false accusations and I'm the guy who always prefers to see the evidence you know true and blue shown in front of me I prefer to see the evidence in front of me regarding the sexual assault or sexual misconduct before I make my opinion I need it right in front of me to show where I stand when it came to Justin Long's character for a bit there wasn't any evidence of him having done it it was just the concept of his character having done a shitty fucking thing and we didn't know but the bar scene came up and immediately I'm like wow you are the biggest tool on the fucking planet and for that I couldn't get behind or side with his character at all but I guess that was the point for his character especially due to the action he takes at the end of the movie selfishly throwing Tess off the top of that fucking water um, tower to save his own ass and it shows that 
he was a shitty person. The fucking creature, or whatever you want to call it in this movie, was fucking whack. Um, a very unique fucking creature, but the entire time, all I could think about was the big titty fucking lady that Pennywise took the form of in It Chapter 2 with the Beverly visiting her old childhood home sequence. Um, but I will say, it provided for some very creepy imagery, some very good sound design. The creature, or person if you want to call it that, um, who was formed through multiple cases of breeding incestually, um... Wow! The design for it was creepy because of that, the sounds it made, and just the lack of speech because that is very accurate if you've seen documentaries on real incestual inbreeding, um, which are very fascinating to watch by the way, how their minds are and the causes of incestuous breeding and everything. Like there are documentaries or reports on it out there where you can watch them and they are very fascinating. Um, especially when they're people born into a world like that. They don't agree with it, but they were born into that, so they can't help the way that they are for that reason. And it's very unfortunate for them. They just try to live normal lives, but they are the way they are because of their parents. With this, though, it created a very interesting concept, especially towards the end, where you're like, is this thing really bad, or does it just want a baby? Does it just want to love something or be loved? And I love that aspect. I like horror movies that have the horror themes in there, but with deeper subject matters at the helm, whether easy to talk about or very touchy, which this movie sort of tackles both. And I appreciate it on that sense. And I think it, for the most part, is very well handled. I just think with the Justin Long character, um, it could have explored his character and what he did a lot more. I just wish that aspect of the movie that was explored on a deeper level, because I think it's a very interesting subject matter that does deserve to be brought to light. Um, and it takes some balls to sub talk about or to cover a subject matter such as um, that. But yeah, I appreciate this movie because of the subject matters it handles. I think the movie could have handled its narrative and also a lot of the deeper stuff a lot better and could have explored it a little bit more. But as a horror movie, it is very well directed. It is very effective. The performances across the board are incredible and is a very unique, unsettling and mysterious concept that I had a lot of fun with. So guys, what did you think of Barbarian? I want to see what you guys have to say down in the comment section below. Do you love it? Do you hate it? Or are you somewhere right in the middle? Just comment down below. Let me know. Do be sure to also click the subscribe button and the bell to get notified when new videos are up every single week. And I'll see you all in the next video. Take care.